In this guide, I'll show you how to fix it when an internal or external SSD is not showing up in disk management or in the BIOS. So the first thing you want to do is open up disk management. To do this, simply go down to search, type in create, and go to create and format hard disk partitions. Now there's a few reasons it might not be showing up. First, make sure that the SATA cables are plugged in for an internal SSD, and for an external SSD, make sure it's plugged in properly as well. You could also try rotating with different USB ports. Now, assuming it's not a cable issue, the next thing I recommend you do is to actually just restart your computer. I've been through a couple different videos trying to figure this out myself. I've seen a lot of comments of people just saying, I restarted my computer, tried it again, and it showed up. Now, the next thing I recommend you do is to actually have a look through here. Sometimes the SSD doesn't always show up where you would expect to. So you may see a box appear here with the actual storage that you've installed. And if you right click on it and see the option to go to new simple volume, then that just may be your SSD. So what I'm going to do now is actually make sure mine's plugged in. So it did show up just beneath the Windows C drive here. So I'm going to right click on it and go to new simple volume. And I'm going to start this wizard by going to next. Gonna go to next here and we're going to assign the drive a letter. I'm just going to leave it on D and go to next. And if this is a new SSD, you can leave these settings except for the volume label where you can give it a name. Or if this is an old SSD where you wanna keep the stuff on it, go to do not format this volume. So check mark that and then go to next. Then you just wanna to go to finish and it should format and you should see this storage available. And to ensure it's been done correctly, Go down to the search bar, type in file, open up the file explorer, and if we scroll down on the left sidebar, you should see your SSD appear here by your Windows C drive, and it'll show up here as well. If this guide was helpful, like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.